Kim, all the injuries, all the surgeries, all the rehab, does this make it all worthwhile? That was an amazing win. Yeah. <laughs> um, thank you. I would say that um, even without this win today, it's worthwhile. Um, I'm doing what I absolutely love and not many people get to wake up and live their dream and um, know that so many people are supporting me, just not, not just my family, my friends who I know personally, but um, so many people that are watching here today and, and back home um, on TV. Thank you so much, I, I love you all. She's a seed. She's a seven-time quarter-finalist. This is her 14th Australian Open. That is a significant win. And you were nearly gone. You were one game away. How did you turn it around? To be honest, I was trying not to think about it. Uh, I knew she was a quality player, and I know how deep she's gone in slams. And I saw Maddie play her last year, so uh, Maddie's a great player. And to, to beat her on a roll um, like she did last year was, was great. So. Um, yeah, congrats to, for her on all the success that she's had. And I'm so happy that I won today and I get to play again. Thank you. Absolutely. You live to fight another day. Let's hope it's out here on this court and you get the support that you did. But it's Linda Fruvatova. She's only 17 years of age. Any thoughts on her? I, I've heard her name and I've seen her play a little bit. I know she's one of the up and coming, um, next up and coming players of our generation. So, um, look, everyone who plays in the main draw of a Grand Slam is really good. So, I'm um, expecting another battle and um, yeah, I'm going to enjoy every second. Thanks, Wally. Absolutely. Mum and Dad are in the stands. Well done, Kim.